The 19th Africa Athletics Championships will be held one week after the Commonwealth Games. And so this year's Kenya National Trials serve the purpose of selecting both teams. Now, some athletes will be allowed to compete in the Commonwealth and the Africa Championships, especially in the middle distances. However, the Africa Championships is more attractive for many athletes. This is because if they do well at the Africa competition, then they will get a chance to represent the continent at the World Cup to be held later this year in Morocco. Especially those athletes that have been doing very well at the, at the Diamond League, uh, they would prefer to run the, the Africa Championship. Uh, I think the expectation from AK is that uh, we are going to have a very strong team for both uh, the Commonwealth and also the African Championships. Helen Obiri has been in blistering form so far this season and she continued this on Saturday winning the national championship. The world championship bronze medalist is eyeing gold medals both in the Commonwealth and African championships. I think what I've changed for me, I try to react 200 meters, speed work, a lot of speed work and I concentrate for what I'm doing. 800-meter world record holder David Rudisha is among the athletes who earned a wild card to the Glasgow Games, even as he returns from a 12-month break due to injury. For 1,500-meter world champion Asbel Kiprop, his focus is beyond the Commonwealth or African meets. He is chasing the world record of 3 minutes 26 seconds held by retired Moroccan athlete Hisham El Gerouj. It's my focus. Um, it's called a world record attempt. It's a world record trial I am going to, to do in Monaco. And um, that was my focus for this year uh, with the world relays. And I'm looking forward. On the field, Julius Yago nicknamed YouTube athlete after learning how to throw the javelin by watching clips from the video sharing site. will be looking for double glory at the Commonwealth and Africa Championships. Yago, who is the national record holder, finished fourth at the World Championships last year. I have that confidence being in the World Championships last year. It, so it was emotional being third and then to fourth, but looking at the distance I achieved my personal best, 85 meters. So it was a big improvement on, on my performance. Kenya will be looking to win the African competition after finishing second to Nigeria at the 2012 Championships in Benin. Selassie Karone, CCTV, Nairobi.